So are you ready to die? Claws, once again, strike. <sighs> fetch! Fetch! Doctor, why are you shouting fetch? Well, you'll understand in a minute. Well, if he comes, because he, he promised me if I shout fetch, then he'll arrive. Hello, who will arrive? Prepare to die, you green Slovene. <coughs> Quick, I missed, but hop out of me. I still have my emergency teleport working. Three, two, one. <coughs> Ow, my head. What do you mean, on my head? I mean, why did the... Uh, God, why do we have to land so hard? Um, well, it's not the doctor's fault, it's Canine's fault. So you blame me now? I mean, after all I help you all those times, you still blame me? Well, just give it a rest, you lot. <sighs> we still haven't escaped from that mighty Slovene. With its green body and its claws of terror. <sighs> God, I mean... What if it tracks us down? I mean, did we really get rid of it? Because you did say you missed it, didn't you? Unfortunately, yes. Oh, damn you. Anyway, we will have to find it before it finds us and kill us. But before that, we have to kill the Slovene. Oh, wait, but what about my TARDIS? I mean... It's still on the, still on the mountain, miles away from where we are. I mean, I don't even know where we are. Right. Hey, Dad, do you have a problem? I mean, do you have a problem on, um, being in the TARDIS to us? No, it's easy peasy. I mean, I can just do it in three, two, one, and bam, your TARDIS will be right in front of you. So, are you sure it works? Yes, I am sure. Three, two, one. See? It works. Well, yes, it sure does work, but why is Martha lying on the floor? What do you mean I'm lying on the floor? Your, your stupid Tidus just landed on me. And I feel like the witch in The Wizard of Oz. Ah, can you? I need some help. Okay, Martha. God. You're always annoying, aren't you? Stop being cheeky. But, Martha, don't worry, Captain Jack's always cheeky. I'm not. Hit three, two, one, and pull. Oops, I didn't miss. Didn't grab onto you. Three, two, one. Uh, God, you weigh a lot of weight, don't you? Uh, I'm not fat. I do go to Weight Watchers. Yeah, sure you do. Anyway, I'm not even sure if Weight Watchers is a place. I mean, what the hell is Weight Watchers? Well, why are you even talking about it? Because you two are talking about it. Okay, this is getting confusing. Uh, canine, thank you. Um, thank you for being the TARDIS to us and not hitting the Slovene. Now that's going to be our problem. Well, glad I helped. Goodbye. And remember, whenever you need help, just shout, fetch. <coughs> ah, so, K9 has now gone, and now I guess it's us three to deal with the Slovene. Well, Captain Jack, Martha, you, start practicing. In my TARDIS, there is... A training gym where you can fight no don't fight each other but fight some dummies some plastic dummies but you can pretend that the Slovene is a dummy and you just fight it so you free just start training and I'll just be having a cup of tea in the tea room that's why it's called the tea room because you have tea Anyway, start training. Ah, so I finally found the training room. 
and we found the dummy of the Slovene. And it just looks like the real Slovene. But we all know it's a dummy, just as the doctor said. Unless he lies, because the doctor always lies. Anyway, you sure it's not a dummy? Yes, I'm pretty much sure, Captain Jack. Uh, right, who wants a punch first? Um, you can, Captain Jack. Yes, because it's always the male people. Women always come last, don't they? Well, you always say, ladies go first, but today, you go first, Captain Jack. While I just sit back here in the dark, hiding. Oh, you're so suspicious. It's even a dummy look. <laughs> I now have you in my hands, and now what are you going to do, you useless piece of human? Yeah. Doctor, help, help! Oh, what is it now, Captain Jack? I've just been enjoying my lovely cup of tea, and now you have to interrupt me, don't you? I'm coming. Oh, God. You said this was a dummy, Doctor. Well, I thought that too, but it seems to be a real Slovene. God, it's on top of me. Yes, just... I'm trying. Okay, so... After three hours, we finally got strapped to the wall. And we're going to open up a portal. Which will... Alert the Jadoon to take it back to the planet moon. Where the prison is. And by the law, the Slovene, you will be arrested. And there will be no slime dropping on us again. Did you like what I said, Doctor? No slime dropping on us again? Yes, well, haha, very funny. Not as funny as my jokes. Oh. Anyway. Opening the portal in three. Two. Go, bo, no, bo, jo, bo, do. You are the Slovene. No, I'm not the Slovene. Behind you. <sighs> oh. You are the Slovene. By the way, Doctor, I'm really sorry. I really, really am. Anyway, you will be taken to the prison on the moon. Prepare to be arrested for life. <laughs> so has it gone? That weird claw person? Do you mean the Slovene? Yes, the Javine. No, it's the Slovene. Not Marie, not Devine, like I said before, just Slovene. Oh, okay then. Anyway, now that's gone, um, what should we do? Wait, I can hear my phone ringing on my side. Quick. All goes to Captain Jack. He stores a teleporter, don't you? Well, thankfully, yes I do. Uh, just in time, the telephone's still ringing. Uh, opening the door. Hello? Joe Halloran? Who is Joe Halloran? I demand you to tell me who Joe Halloran is. He's a detective and he wants to work with me. Well, we'll see about that. We'll see how good he is at fighting monsters, just like me, because no one will ever beat me. I am the top monster fighter. Ah! I fell down. I, it's okay. I'm okay, you two. I've just got to find a way back up. Captain Jack, can you teleport me, please? Oh, silly doctor. All right, careful. We are on the edge of a really steep cliff, you know, so I'm surprised you didn't break your back. Anyway, you three ready to board the TARDIS? Well, come on then. It's been a hell of a journey. <sighs> Can't wait to see who this Joe Halloran is. Apparently he's like Sherlock Holmes, but it's weirdly enough, I haven't heard of Sherlock Holmes before, so we will have to find out how good he actually is at fighting crime. So, 
Who wants a cup of tea? Me please, me please. Okay, there's only four mugs. And there's only two of you. Don't you mean there's three of us? Oh, sorry, my math is rubbish, you know. You see, I've never attended school. I've just travelled all my life. But I can always go back in time to school. Which I don't think anyone would. Anyway, off for another adventure.